All right, guys, let's check this out real quick. All right, so we got Casino Crown um, salt machine. Does work. And I have put money in it before, and I've already won my money back. Uh, see if we can get a win real quick. Maybe. <laughs> it's not one. Basically, we need uh, at least two. At least one, but more like two crowns. All right, one more, one more, last one. Uh, nothing. Maybe we'll come back to it in a little bit. All right, so we found that. We got this really cool looking mirror here. Gold in color. Antique-ish looking. Uh, um, then we have this box here. <clears throat> We've got lots of different movies mixed in here. Looks like VHS and DVDs. And what is that? X. I don't know. Some kind of CD, I guess. A parental advisory. So we got movies. Oh, look. Is this a Blu ray? No. It's just a blue case. Um, but, I mean, yeah, we got DVDs, we got, uh, VHS, cruise over here, got some more DVDs, uh, I was pulling all these out, we got some more CDs there, these ones, they're not in their actual case, but it says Independence Day Blu-ray, and I pulled it out, it is Independence Day, uh, Blu-ray, and the disc is an actual Blu-ray disc, not just... You know, it doesn't look like it's a burn either. Um, so, I mean, we got Rise of the Guardians on DVD. Killers on Blu-ray. Born Supremacy. Um, that is a Blu-ray. We have Garfield. Uh, that looks like a burn. I don't want to pull it out. Oh, we have Rise of the Guardians Blu-ray 3D. Blazing Saddles Blu-ray, uh, the Blues Brothers Blu-ray, Inside Man, so I mean we got a bunch of Blu-rays there, same with, um, you can see that stack there, those are all movies, uh, those cases, these cases here are full of CDs and DVDs and PlayStation games, speakers that were in there, those are going to be trash, that's why they're on the ground. Alright, so we got more boxes. Uh, you can see extension cords, more clothes, we got binoculars here, we've got, you know, other stuff. Haven't gone through that box too well. Uh, mainly junk in there, same with this, that's a UV light. Uh, more stuff here, it's pretty much junk. All these boxes, you know, the boxes were pretty much all junk this time. So there's no point in really showing you any of the boxes. Um, so... And this lonesome jack way out here by itself. Uh, pretty big floor jack. That was in there. Uh, these nasty mattresses that will be donated were in there. Um, then we have this here that you can see. This is one piece. And then we have this piece here that is part of it. And then we have this. Basically, this part here is a bed. It's on its side right now, but it's a bed. And it screws on to this piece here and this piece here. And so it sits on top and then you have it underneath to be able to store stuff. We got drawers. Um, there's still some stuff in some of... Oh, I got the hiccups. Some of these drawers. Um, this furniture dolly. This was in there. Uh, we, have, we have test strips that are in there. Um, we have the actual... Uh, needles for uh, testing your blood sugar. Uh, they're all brand new sealed. Uh, I do have somebody I may be donating these to or they may purchase them. Um, anyway, uh, we've got some just little knickknacks and stuff in here. I don't know what this thing is. is it? Oh, doesn't smell like anything. Um, we have some Cool things here. I used to have one of these actually. 
This is a glow in the dark jellyfish. Um, so just a bunch of little knickknacks in this box. We've got, uh, you can see this camera here. There's another camera in here. There's an uh, optical mouse. That screws away. This dresser, that all this stuff is on here. This dresser here, that was in there. Um, those those are part of a bed, uh, you know, I don't know where the other part of it is, the boards that connect it. Um, they're obviously not with it, for whatever reason. See those two end tables? Those are matching, and they also go with that coffee table over there. Uh, we got this bench, we got that thing, we got this dresser, we have this little bench seat, and this table. Here's the front of that dresser. Um, there's also a pogo stick. Um, let's see if I can show it to you. It's in the garage. Um, there are a few other things, you know. Uh, let's see. Some of the stuff got thrown up in here. There's a couple boxes here. Uh, this ice chest. That furniture piece there was in there. Uh, this little buffer thing. Mattress. This wet vac, uh, pump for the mattress. There's also another pump somewhere else. This thing here, this is pretty cool. And, and that is glass. Uh, Budweiser, king of beers, because it's football. Pretty cool. Uh, giant bear was in there. I don't know why that pillow was up there. That's tr gonna be trashed. I don't keep that stuff. Uh, both these little end tables here. We're in there, uh, that helmet on the table over there. Uh, this sh shredder, this metal, uh, like candle holder thing. That's pretty much it. Let me, uh, oh, you know, there are, there's a few bags of clothes and boxes of clothes over there that were in it. And there's some more dishes, uh, like kitchenware and stuff. Same here. We got more trapped up. Um, those are more cords that are going to be recycled. Uh, those you know, crock pot and pressure cooker was in there. Sorry guys, I'm trying not to pan too fast to make you motion sick or anything. Basically, you know, like I said, those boxes were pretty much junk. Let me cruise over here and show you this awesome pogo stick. So we got this pogo stick here. Uh, I have looked this up. I, you know, this was right in the front of the unit, which I'm surprised nobody really wanted to bid just based off this um i you know i've looked these up before and i've seen them as high as 800 dollars for these pogo sticks um i did look up this specific one after purchasing it and brand new this one is uh 577 dollars brand new uh and that would be like on ebay and everything um Used, they go for about 100, 150. Uh, I mean, this thing's pretty cool. I tried it out. It's fun. Bounce really high. Oh, this chair here was also in there. Looks like you know, like a director's chair or something that you would see on a movie set. There's no name on it though. But uh, yeah, so that was in there. And that thing will bounces you really good. <laughs> uh, also, this box here. Um, only this, you know, this speaker here that you can see looks, you know, like the sub speaker. That looks like it's underneath. I haven't even pulled that out yet. And then that's a CD changer, FM player, tape deck, you name it. It's got it type deal. Um, so that's pretty much everything. Uh, I don't think there's anything else left to show you from this unit. I'm pretty sure that's about everything. Uh, so, yeah. Alright, see you guys next time. Alright guys, one more quick thing I forgot to show you. There was also uh, a whole bunch of watches and there's one that's it's a Rolex. As you can see there, Rolex Oyster Perpetual Date Just. Uh, so this is the last thing I want to show you. Whether it's real or not, I don't know, I have to get it checked out. And also the uh, little piece that holds the clasping piece, 
that holds it on your wrist is gone. But still, I mean, it's a Rolex. So hopefully it's real. Uh, if not, darn.